WrestleMania weekend rolls on. I'm Matt Carlins, and this is Just Pro Wrestling News for Sunday, April 3rd, 2022. This update is brought to you by IndieWrestling.us. That's Indie with a Y. WWE. It's WrestleMania Sunday tonight at AT AT&T Stadium in Arlington, Texas. The main event, Universal Champion Roman Reigns versus WWE Champion Brock Lesnar. It's winner take all. RK-Bro defends the Raw Tag Titles in a three-way against Alpha Academy and the Street Profits. The WWE Women's Tag Titles are on the line in a four-way. Carmella and Queen Zelina defend against Sasha Banks and Naomi, Rhea Ripley and Liv Morgan, and Natalya and Shayna Baszler. Also tonight, Sami Zayn versus Johnny Knoxville in an Anything Goes match, AJ Styles versus Edge, Bobby Lashley versus Amos, Austin Theory versus Pat McAfee, and a late addition to the Sunday card, Kofi Kingston and Xavier Woods versus Sheamus and Ridge Holland. That was supposed to happen on Saturday, but it was cut due to time. Start time for the main card Sunday is 8 p.m. Eastern on Peacock in the U.S. and the WWE Network around the rest of the world. The pre-show begins at 6. WrestleMania Saturday saw Stone Cold Steve Austin wrestle his first match in 19 years. At the age of 57, Austin beat Kevin Owens in a no-holds-barred main event that lasted around 14 minutes. Cody Rhodes is officially back in WWE. He returned and beat Seth Rollins last night. Rhodes' representatives later announced that he has signed a multi-year contract with WWE. Bianca Belair is the new Raw Women's Champion. She got her revenge on Becky Lynch and handed Lynch her first title match loss in nearly two years. Charlotte Flair is still the SmackDown Women's Champion. She got the upset win over Ronda Rousey, handing Rousey her first singles loss in WWE. The show opened with the Usos beating Shinsuke Nakamura and Rick Boogs to retain the SmackDown tag titles, but the big story here was Boogs suffering a major leg injury during the match. Michael Cole later announced that Boogs suffered a torn quadricep patella. He will need surgery. The Miz and Logan Paul beat Ray and Dominic Mysterio. After the match, Miz turned on Paul. Also last night, Drew McIntyre beat Happy Corbin. WWE confirmed that WrestleMania 39 next year will be two nights on April 1st and 2nd. NXT stand and deliver on Saturday afternoon, and Dolph Ziggler is still the NXT champion. He beat Braun Breaker in the main event. Mandy Rose held on to the NXT women's title. She pinned Io Shirai to win a four-way that also included Cora Jade and Kaylee Ray. Cameron Grimes is the new North American champion. He dethroned Carmelo Hayes in a ladder match that also had Sola Sokoa, Grayson Waller, and Santos Escobar. MSK are the new NXT tag champs. They won the titles from Imperium in a three-way that also included the Creed brothers. Tony D'Angelo beat Tommaso Ciampa This was presented as Ciampa's NXT Farewell, and Triple H greeted Ciampa on stage after the match. Also on the show, Gunther beat LA Knight. More indies are running shows in the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex on Sunday. Some are even running during WrestleMania Sunday. There's a Texas Mania show late Sunday night that has Shane Taylor vs. Low Key on the card. PCO was a late scratch for GCW's Joey Janela's Spring Break 6 Part 2. PCO suffered a shoulder injury. It happened during Impact's Multiverse of Matches show on Friday night, but it's not believed to be serious. Also at Spring Break Part 2, Chris Dickinson beat Matt Cardona, and Minoru Suzuki got a win over Effie. That is just pro wrestling news for Sunday, April 3rd. Our next update comes your way tomorrow morning so please rate review subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss a thing you can also support us by checking out our patreon page i'm matt carlins thank you for listening this show is a member of the sorgatron media podcast network find out more at sorgatronmedia.com